Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out how to animate text on path in After Effects. I'm also going to drop 3D tutorials occasionally on the YouTube members only channel. If you want to check out how to make this optical wormhole animation in Cinema 4D, you can join and select secret content to watch more advanced methods and techniques and become a better designer. Now, let's get back to our tutorial. First step, let's select the type tool, which is located here. Click, type in whatever you want. And from here, make sure that you're on the text layer and select the pen tool. And we're going to start creating waves on the text layer. So I'm going to start from here. And at the end, I'm going to go all the way around and I'm going to connect it with the first anchor point. And you also can recustomize the anchor points. You can just click on one of the anchor points and you also can pull the handles and readjust it however you like. Good. Now we're going to go to the text and we're going to select the text here and we're going to go to the path option. And now we're going to put the text on the path. We get a path, select the none and select mask one. And of course the text is somewhere around here outside. I'm also going to increase the, the text size. And now I'm going to push it out. We got here the first margin. We can move around on the path. So I'm going to start moving it around. I also can animate this. You can click on the first margin stopwatch. You can move it to the second seconds and increase it even more. You can see we got an animation going on here. But we're going to do something even better. I'm going to deactivate the stopwatch and I'm going to press and hold Alt and click on the stopwatch. And we're going to type in time star. I'm going to go with 400. This is going to be 400 is going to be the speed of the animation. Because it's outside, what I'm going to do is go to composition, composition settings, and I'm going to increase it to 20 seconds instead of 10 seconds. Click OK. I'm going to drag this here all the way out. I'm going to drag the layer all the way out. And now I can move. As you can see, the text is going to go out and now it's going to be visible. Now you also can put the text on the left or on the right. We got the reverse path. You can activate that and it's going to put on the other side. For me, this is good. Now I'm going to select the text. I'm going to click Control A, Control C. I'm going to go all the way to the end and press Control V. Copy paste it until it goes round and round. And it's going to connect somewhere there. It might not be perfect, but we're going to check it out. But you also can change that and customize it by going to the text size, you know. If you increase it or decrease it, they're going to start connecting however you want. And this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye.